Hi, welcome to Gyeong's Kitchen. Thank you for watching. 안녕하세요. Today I'm going to share brand new recipe that Law inspired me called carrot cookies. This is a soft, delicious, and healthy cookies. Let's go and start. First, you will need one and a half a cup unbleached white flour. And since I'm using the unbleached white flour, I'm going to add in back the nutrition. So you need a 3 tablespoon with jam. With jam is high in protein, fibers, minerals, vitamins. And adding, this is cookie, so it needs to be sweet. So I'm adding a half cup tabinari sugar, which is a first sugar from the cane, making a sugar. So this is a more nutrition value in it. Next, you will need stevia. I need a two teaspoon stevia. So six package makes two teaspoons stevia. Stevia is a natural sweetener. A substrate from a stevia plant, and it has zero calories. Still gives lots of sweetness. I'm always mixing with tabinara sugar and stevia to make a low in sugar cookies, but still delicious. Good for you. Next, you will need a half teaspoon salt, a one tablespoon aluminum free baking powder, and next, you will need a half cup carrot powder. It looks like a cocoa powder. But the uh, carrot powder is a chocolate substitute and very high in antioxidant and highly alkaline. When your body is alkaline and cancer cannot grow and uh, contains no caffeine and chocolate contains caffeine. Then also contain natural sugar high in calcium, potassium, magnesium, and iron. Also high in vitamin A, vitamin B1, B2, and vitamin E, and vitamin K. And low in starch, and very low in fat. Wow, <laughs> wonderful. Amazing health benefit is to manage your or prevent diabetes and the prevent heart disease and slow down aging and boost digestion and prevent cancer and build immunity. Wonderful, wonderful. And mix the dry ingredients first. Okay, turn your oven at 350 degrees. Then mix the uh, dry ingredients thoroughly. And do not use the whole wheat flour for these cookies, but it will be a little uh, tough. But this is a soft cookie. We love soft. Okay. After that, adding three fourths cup soy milk or any non-dairy milk. This is a vegan cookie. Then you will need a half cup. Vegan butter. If you like to make a healthy vegan butter at home, just type the Gyeong's butter on YouTube. Real, real, real simple to make. Then last one is one teaspoon vanilla. So this is a homemade butter. I mix it. It takes time to mix it. Sometimes it's good to just put your hands in here. <laughs> this is a, a press gum. This is a really good cookie recipe. I'm not, I don't really eat cookie much, even though vegan cookies. However, I really like this one. One time I sat and I had three cookies. <laughs> so, 
I'm going to continue mix it until all the dry ingredients and the wet ingredients mingle together. Okay, almost done. My mom, she is a really good cook. And when I was a teenager, I asked her, Mom, how did you learn to cook so well? And do you know what she said? The secret of the good cook is you know how to mix well. So it takes some time to mix all together. All right, mixing is done. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> What I'm going to do is go and put it here and if you have an ice cream scooper it will work really good. This one makes 24 cookies so you can just put it here and now we're going to put three. Now I'll just show you. Now from here we don't have any baking soda, so it's not gonna flatten by itself. So you need to wet your finger in the water like this, then just flatten like that. How simple is that? So your family can enjoy healthy, delicious cookie at home. So. I have finished product for you. Here you go. This one is so soft. You can even just break it like this. Mmm, delicious. So thank you for watching. And the written recipe is in the description. So see you until next program. May God richly bless you.